Are you falling asleep? Eli. Hey, buddy. God, I know. I know. We love the car rides. We love our car rides. Yeah. I know. Tell everybody. Tell everybody how much you love your car rides. Tell everybody. That was napping a second ago. Right? That was napping a second ago. Hi, everybody. This is Tiffany. And you all know this adorable little face. This is Eli. Right, Eli? Right, Eli? Hi, boo-boo. So we are in the car because I just um, took Eli up to Boca to do a meet and greet with a, a absolutely wonderful family. They came to meet him two weeks ago, fell in love, but we needed to wait until um, he was treated for kennel cough in order to introduce the dogs. So today was the day that we were bringing him up there to do the meet and greet and the home check and hopefully leave him in a wonderful home. But sadly, uh, one of their dogs was fantastic. The other one did not want Eli in his home. So unfortunately, that did not work out and we were all set too. So he got his bag with all his stuff and they even bought him a Christmas sweater, which they gave to me to give to him anyway. So cute. Um, but sadly, it just wasn't a match. And this, this is why we do meet and greets with every single dog, why we insist on doing meet and greets, because you just never know. So we are now back at Imperial Point Animal Hospital. And this little boy is still in search of a forever loving home. Right, buddy? He is just the sweetest, goofiest little boy who just wants to be on your lap, who wants to snuggle. Right, buddy? And who absolutely wants to go for car rides with you all the time. We can't even take him for a walk because if he sees a car, he runs straight to the car and stands there and won't move because he wants to get in the car and go for a car ride. Handsome. This is not the best angle. There we go. Hi, bud. Hi, buddy. So, we are posting this in hopes of finding Eli another potential home since this one didn't work out. He is an absolute doll. Can't say enough good things about him. His personality is off the charts adorable. He looks at you sometimes like he's just going to open his mouth and talk to you. And he bounces around the room. He loves his treats. Loves his belly rubs. Not a fan, big fan of the walking because he'd rather be charioted around in a car. Right, buddy? Right, buddy? Eli. A video of you snoring in bed is not the most exciting. Eli. Eli. <laughs> Eli, Eli, Eli. Come here. Look at me. Eli. <gasps> hey. Are you really that tired? You can't be that tired. Oh, oh there we go. There you are. There you are. There's our boy. Handsome. What you doing? Hi, buddy. His hair is starting to grow back. He's got all this little peach fuzz on his head. Oh, now we're up and alert. Right? Now we're up and alert because I opened the door. Look at that face. How could you not want to look at that face every single day? day in and day out. He is perfection. He's absolutely adorable. And he needs a home. 
He needs a car to ride in. He needs a lap to chill on. He needs a bed to sleep in with his people. He's a uh, Shih Tzu pug mix. Absolutely adorable. He will be neutered probably in another week to two weeks. We just want to make sure he's completely healthy and, and ready for anesthesia. Um, his hair, like as you could see, is already growing in again. We still have the shirt on to keep him from scratching himself. Hey, let me see. See, we're still a little bit naked under there, but the hair is starting to grow in. Saved from death row in Miami-Dade Animal Services. He was a completely matted, matted mess. You couldn't even see his face in his intake picture. And he had to be completely shaved. And he was in isolation with kennel cough, so nobody was seeing him. So when we got the, the message, we ran down there to save his life. And boy, was he such a good save. He has got the most adorable, adorable, adorable personality. I can't even put it into words. It's just something you need to experience for yourself. <laughs> so this is Eli. Eli is in search of his forever home. We are going to go get him back settled in his run with all his toys and his bed and all of his things. Um, but it's not a home. So please, guys, share this video of Eli. If you are interested in meeting him, send us an email to 100plusabandonedogs at gmail.com with all your information. Um, or you can give us a call at 888-506-8100 if you'd like to meet our Eli. He seems to be okay with dogs. He's not really bothered one way or the other. Um, the other dog in the household, I said, well, just was really not not taking to him um, but the first one didn't mind him at all and Eli didn't mind the other dog so if you have dogs of course a meet and greet is a must that's why we do these things <laughs> did you find your little bone in the bed did you find your little bone in the bed yes you did so once again, the phone number is 888-506-8100 if you are interested in Eli. Or you can email us at 100plusabandonedogs at gmail.com with all of your contact information. And we can set up a time for you to meet him. He is here at BCA Imperial Point Animal Hospital in Fort Lauderdale. Um, and we want nothing more than to get him out of here and into a loving forever home. Eli, I got the back of your head here, buddy. Eli, look, I opened the door. Can you look this way? Hi, Vanessa! <laughs> Eli! No, I'm busy chewing on my treat, lady. I don't want to look at the camera right now. So, please share. And once again, if you are interested in meeting Eli, you can give us a call at 888-506-8100 or you can email us at 100plusabandonedogs at gmail.com. I'm going to go bring him back inside and get him settled. This is Tiffany with our little Eli. 100 plus abandoned dogs at, of Everglades, Florida. Sorry, I got a little tongue tied. Look at all the hearts. I see your hearts, Lori. Ha, ha, ha.